Welcome to T2T Boxing in association with IFL TV and KO Clothing. Here with me I'm joined by 4-0 heavyweight sensation Willis Meehan. Thanks for joining us Willis. Thank you man. Up here at the, uh, the local gym in, uh, in Wyong, training with, uh, training with your dad ahead of your, uh, your next fight. I understand you've now got an opponent for that night as well. Yeah, yeah um, I've been training hard up here. It's good you know, to get away from the city and get some good work done. And uh, Coming up against a tough dude, uh, Limi Taito. He's 3-2 uh, as a professional boxer. and. Um, a whole bunch of kickboxing and MMA fights, so yeah, it'll be a good fight. Yeah, uh, so yeah, very sort of um, rugged man, and mm -hmm. you know, what um, what are you looking to uh, to work on in these fights? You know, three and zero now. This will take you to you know, with the win four and zero. What are your plans in terms of that fight and the style that you want to take in there? Um, I guess you know, I've got the same my same style, um, very elusive, start a fighter from the outside and come in and bang when I need to, and um, I guess just gaining experience from all these fights and. Picking up little things that are, you know, that are every time I get in the ring, come out with something new. So, looking forward to it. Is there is there anything that you've seen from you know yourself so far in inspiring and in the ring that you know is going to be the key to, to winning a lot of fights? You know, obviously you had a couple of big knockouts, particularly on the on the Gill Fletcher undercard. That was a yeah, huge knockout. Is that um, have you seen enough in yourself so far to know that you know you're going to go as far, if not further, than than the old man? Yeah. Well. Um, you know, I'm confident in my ability, you know, I, uh, I think the advantage I've got a lot, of, a lot of fighters is I can switch, fight southpaw, fight orthodox, and quite comfortably I do both, so um, just, I guess, just taking all the experience in and learning a lot of that and, uh, you know, putting it into practice every time I get this world-class sparring with everyone and come come fight time, you know, get the job done. I see, and I know you've um, you had some great sparring partners recently, I think, you know, we saw you eight, nine months ago sparring with Alex Leopai. Since then, I know you've been sparring with you know, the likes of Lucas Brown and things like that. So fighting with these fighters who are at that, you know, been through that level, you know, 23, 24 and 0 kind of fighters, what's it like, you know, for someone like yourself to, to get in the ring with these guys and have some success? Yeah, it's um, good confidence for myself. You know, I get in there and I um, match up with these guys physically and skillfully and, um, you know, it's a bit of a gauge to see where I'm at. And every time I hop out of the ring with these experienced guys, you know, I'm happy with my performance. And uh, I guess just every time turning up, just getting ready, getting ready, and walking away feeling good. Yes, and, and fighting on the same card, obviously, as your dad, uh, Carly, on uh, October 15th. What, um, what's that like as a, as a fighter? Not many people obviously experience that or have ever seen that. What's it like training with, training with your dad and, and going to fight on the same night? Oh, man, it's, uh, it's a dream come true, you know. Thank God every time, um, second time, now we get to do it together. And uh, this is going to be a massive night, you know, biggest fight since Tour Cameron in New Zealand. And... Um, all my family's going to be there. So I guess I've just got to not let the occasion get to me and just get out there and do my job. Absolutely, yeah, it's a huge fight. And what are your thoughts on, say, on that, on that fight, Meehan Parker? Uh, Parker's obviously the up-and-comer. Your dad's obviously the, you know, the, the name that's been in that division for a long time in Australia and New Zealand. How, um, how do you see it going? You've obviously seen him in training. Yeah, well, it's, um, it's a fantasy fight for the fans. You know, Some people never dreamed of this fight happening. And um, I guess it's awesome for our family, you know, getting there. I know he's still got what he what he what he has his power his strength. Um, I guess it just depends on who who turns up on the night, who trains the hardest, and uh, we come for the win. And if uh, if there is a a win there for Carly and, and he overcomes Park, you know, he set himself up for pretty much any fight that he wants out there, particularly in the uh, in the southern hemisphere. Is there anyone that you'd like to see him up against in say Australia, New Zealand, or or anywhere else if he was to uh, say come over come through this fight with Parker? Oh, God willing, uh, holding that belt, you know, finally after all these years. But um, yeah, I guess just take this one fight at a time for us as a team and uh, see what happens with me. Excellent. And just finally, what's, um, what, what's your prediction for, for your fight on October 15th? Are we going to see another knockout from Willis Meehan? Uh, God willing, come in oh. first or second, I reckon. <laughs> Excellent. All right, thanks a lot for your time. Look, I know you've got a lot of training to get through today, but uh, yeah, we we'll wish you all the best and we'll speak to you soon. Thank you. Cheers, Willis.